guys, it's Ashley from Book Haul of Synonymous, and this is my June TBR. It's what, the 11th or 12th? I don't know. So it's halfway through the month. I know. Always late, guys. Always late. <clears throat> so with that being said, this is my list of books that I want to read. So, no, you probably can't read them, but yeah. And that being said, I've already read one, two, three, five of them. So I'll do those first just because. Um so the we'll, we'll go with the first two. Hold on. Yeah. The first two that I read I actually were actual actually audiobooks. And that was Felix Ever After by Kaysen Callender. I really actually enjoyed it was a really good story so. and then the second was Pumpkin by Julie Murphy which is the third um, companion type novel in the Dumplin series which is weird because I read Dumplin I haven't read the second one which was put in I believe and then Pumpkin and then there's Sweet Pea is like in between one of those which I have but I haven't read and that's the middle grade but. so yeah those are the two those are two of the audiobooks that I've already read and listened or I've listened to. So <clears throat> there's that. Now for the books that I've already actually read. And those were Tweet Cute by Emma Lord, which was adorable. I loved the characters in it. The next one was Bittersweet by Serena Bowen. About Griff and Audrey, which I absolutely loved as well, because oh. yes, <clears throat> all the hotness and the sexiness, and yeah, there was. That. And then the first book, the uh, first book I actually read at the beginning of the month was *The Lost Apothecary* by Sarah Pennant, which it's not normally a book that I would gravitate towards but I really enjoyed it and I enjoyed the, like the timeline and the two different perspectives from different centuries so yeah those are all the ones I've read so far so I am now listening to on audio Beauty Queens by Libba Bray which I'm actually really enjoying like the the narrator that does it, her, she changes her voices for the different um, contestants, which is fun to listen to. But I will say the Texas one this is not how we sound, in my opinion, but that's just me. Because that is like very, very southern. I'm just like, that's not us, but I've lived here all my life, so I don't know. You know, maybe we sound like that to outsiders <laughs> or other states. I don't know. So. <clears throat> With that being said, the, the book I'm actually reading is The Lake by Natasha Preston. You guys, her books always mess with me. Like, like they're so messed up, but they're so mind, I don't know, it's just... I don't know. Anyways, I'm like almost done with it. And yeah. So we're reading that. <clears throat> I guess I'll do this. And the Felix Ever After book was actually a book that the page turners book club on Facebook was gonna read which I know they haven't started it but I just went ahead and read it but with that being said Wolf Song by TJ Klune is gonna be the other book that they read so I'm gonna try to read that with them but I don't know I mean I really want to get to it so I either may read it or I don't know if I think this one was also on audio I can't remember, but so and I think this is like a male, male one. So I'm excited to uh, get to it. 
three, our next one is The Invisible Life of Addie LaRue by V.E. Schwab. This one I chose for the, I think it's buzzword thought which actually I chose Beauty Queens and this one because I think it's a name or title. Which, type name and the title Queens. So. We'll see um, if I get to this or not. The next one I want to, to start, this will probably be my next read after I finish the lake, which is The Anatomical Shape of a Heart by Jen Bennett. I am slowly working my way through her books and I've really liked every one of them. <laughs> the next one is, I know this was on my last um, May TBR book, The House in the Cerulean Sea by TJ Klune. This one, I think I was reading for the TBR knockout for June, which was a book that has, um, I don't know, Ten, four more colors maybe? I don't know. I think that's this one now. But so yeah, <coughs> I will probably try to listen to this one as well, if I can. And of course I have yellow, which I did not, I started last month but didn't really get far so there's that I really want to read Lore as well by Alexandra Bracken <coughs> there's that I also want to read Bookish and the Beast by Ashley Ponston which is like the third companion novel to Kikarella and I can't think of the other one the Princess and something I think I'm not sure anyways there's that one and the last one that I have that I keep pushing back to listen to on audio is the War Storm, Storm by Victoria Aviard. I think. Yeah, this is the final book in the Red Queen series. So, I really want to try to get to it. If not this month, hopefully next month. But, yeah. We'll see, because if I can finish the Beauty Queens within a good amount of time I should be able to finish this one as well. Listen to it. So, start. so yeah, those are the books that I want to finish and read for this month. <clears throat> so, uh, wow, that is a whole bunch of you guys. Like, books and I'm also part of this reading challenge or month long reading challenge I guess on one of our Facebook my Facebook groups <clears throat> and it's two teams and it's so much fun I think it's whichever team reaches 600 books first and last I saw our team was in lead and I'm so excited for it so just trying to you know help out so I will see you guys next time